Hi, I'm Real Genetic Demon, and these are ZX Spectrum games based on 1980s TV. So we're up to Knight Rider, um, an absolute classic with Michael Knight, the Hoff, um, in the starring role. So, well, was was he the starring role or was the car the starring role? I I don't know. I think I think the car could possibly have been the starring role. Look at that though. Do you see the picture there? The Hoff was very orange, or was he even red there? Anyway, so let's. Uh, I've got to bring up the virtual keyboard. The mapping for this, because um, oh, I'm running on the Vega, is in the description below. There are four missions to each place before you get to do it. Um, there's a time limit. Um, we've got to, you know, Devon wants you to, to basically um, protect the missile base, so there's some information that we've got to get. So let's go to Chicago first, I think. Right, now. Um, Basically, we have the option to either drive the car, and I've put mapped the button, um, so I'm driving at the moment, and Kit is shooting. Um, I can take damage, um, or we can swap it the other way around, and I'm shooting, and Kit is driving. Not very fast. Come on, Kit, drive a bit faster than 39 miles per hour. I'm going to swap back. I'm going to let. I'm going to drive. Go on, Kit. I'm going to drive. I'm going to get to the full speed. It's not actually a bad driving simulator, really, because I mean, look at the road. It's quite, it's quite um, three-dimensional almost. Um, I'm hoping Kit's quite good at shooting missiles, though, because I've only got so much life. Go on, Kit. You shoot them all down. He's going for it. The only thing missing is a bit of a uh, voice, isn't it? From old Kit saying, you know what he's doing. Go on, Kit. Get those get those missiles from those helicopters. The car's quite robust, really, to be fair, and Kit's quite a good shot. Um, he also can drive if you swap him back. I'll swap him back, and he can drive. Um, oh, he's reduced his speed though significantly. He's, he's he feels that he's a bit worried. He's down to 120 miles per hour just to go through this bit. My laser's getting quite worn as well, though. I've got one. I'm going to use it sparingly. Oh, it's a classic program. Um, Michael Knight was a sort of well, was, he helped. He helped those who needed it. But of course, you had the car involved, and the car was almost was almost indestructible. Um, there was a truck built with it, though, at one point. The reason it was black, though, is to do with this diamond. You could break diamonds on the on the on the on the on the skin of this car. It was that strong. Um, it had its turbo boost that allowed it to jump over huge gullies, and I mean, at, at a top speed at 240 miles per hour, and that very weird-looking uh, um, uh, with steering wheel there that we could see on the screen at the moment, with a sort of two handles on either side. I suppose it's quite Formula One-esque nowadays. I mind you, I think they still have a top and a bottom more than just a, a side thing. So I've now run out of missile things, so I'm just going to have to just going to have to wait it out until we get to our destination because I've run out of if I let go does it recharge no when that's not looking good come on kit we need to go faster I'm gonna drive you you can you can you can you can do that I'm gonna get up to top speed here we're gonna you can I'm gonna drive we're not actually taking that much damage oh he's he's, he's managed to, the end the, the, the laser is uh, uh cooling off I'm guessing is the right word wow ah it's amazing though what grip I've got on the road. It's quite quite stunning really how much I can stick to this road. I might slow down a little bit here. Yeah, Michael steering you see. It says K for Kit and M for Michael. So I'm steering at the moment. Come on, Mike. Come on, Kit. Well done. Did you shoot that or did I get hit by that? I hope you I hope you you got it. It's a long drive. It's a very long level actually. Longer than I thought it was going to be. I'm doing 240 miles per hour though. There we go. Oh, I've arrived at the armory. Current location. Oh, I've got the armory. Sorry, Michael. I can't see anything here. I think we should be in Dallas. Sorry. Oh, so we need to go to Dallas now. So where do we need to go to get to Dallas? I don't know America very well. 
do I need to go to Denver then? Is that closer to Dallas? Atlanta. Atlanta. Right, okay, I'm shooting again. Are you going to drive, Kit? No, I'm... Uh, Kit's, Kit's, Kit's going to shoot. I'm going to drive. It's kind of a, a weird thing because the car's like ha helping you out, which is which is entirely what it does in the TV show, to, show, to be honest with you. So the car is providing that extra support. It's either driving or it's shooting. Um, I quite like the fact that, that though that I can go very very fast indeed. Okay. I like the fact I'm doing 240 at an angle. Yeah, it crashed it a little bit. That's all right. I wonder how whether that the scuds thing on the side there is the distance to my location that I'm going to. I don't know. So they really don't like me. They're sending a barrage of helicopters after me to stop me uh, getting to these destinations to to get better information. It did say I had to go to Dallas, so I assume from Atlanta there must be a way to Dallas. So that's what I'm going to I'm going to assume. Go on, Kit. You're doing quite well there. Huh? He's shooting missiles. So he did let that one get through though. Wasn't that good. I did like Knight Rider. They did do a remake, didn't they? Was it Knight Riders or something similar? With a in the in in the, in the was it the mid nineties or early two thousands? There was a there was a there was a kind of a remake. Um, I don't think I actually watched it. I can't imagine it being. Can't imagine keep bringing the same thrills as that five thirty sort of showing of 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 of, of, of the Hoff and Kit. Um, in their Trans Am because that's what it was. It was a Trans Am. Sorry, spoiled that for anybody who didn't know it was a Trans Am. I think I'm getting there. That's 20, 22. I wonder if that is the distance. It's probably better to drive, actually, considering Kit goes very slowly. He's not a fast driver, is Kit. Which is a surprise, really, because he's the computer. I'm, I'm Michael. I suppose maybe he calculates the risks or something. I don't know. There we go. I can talk to the missile bus, that's all we were before. I can go to Dallas. Okay, I'm going to swap again and I'm going to drive, going at full speed. So we're obviously breaking down the mystery here, working out what's going on, preventing whatever horrible disaster we're preventing this time round. Possibly. So it's a lot of driving. Or it's a lot of, uh, or it's a lot of shooting, and I have to admit, after playing it for a while now, um, it's better to let Kit shoot and you to drive because you can get there an awful lot faster. In fact, because I, because I'm sort of crazily driving at 240 miles per hour, um, that makes a lot of sense. Um, whereas if you let Kit do it, he goes. Well, if I, I watch when it, we swap back to Kit, look, he, he decelerates. What are you decelerating for, Kit? I'm going back again. I'm swapped back. I'm driving again. Right. I think we'll try and get to this. Uh, we'll try and get to Dallas, um, and we'll see what it says in Dallas. But uh, we'll probably call it a day after that. I've really quite enjoyed playing this. Um, I've also done a few other um, videos on uh, 80s TV. Um, if you care to have a little look, um, and also there's there are hundreds of videos on preloaded games on the Vega if you're interested in that as well look at those helicopters just just coming in over the top there 100, 100 scuds to go I like the way that as I say I like the way I can just do 240 miles per hour just glued to the road there doesn't seem to be much in the uh, the turns However, I quite, I'm quite liking the look of them. It's a bit weird, though, that with the blue road, it kind of makes me think that I'm driving across the ocean, but I'm not, clearly not. Yeah, 72. Here we go. Come on, then, Kit. Shoot as much as you can. I just got him to say Michael. Michael. Can we turbo boost? I don't think we can. I suppose 240 miles an hour is fast enough. 
I wonder what he went to on the speedo. I'm sure it kind of hit something like 300 miles per hour when he did his turbo boost jumpy thing. Here we go. Come on, then. Okay. 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 It's there. Here we go. Almost there. Run down. There we go. And let's look talk to the armory in Dallas. Ah, oh, I'm in the armory. Oh, so there's something to this. I have to I guess I must sneak through when they're not looking. Past these people. Careful. Ah, oh, he spotted me. Oh, so Oh, got me! Oh, so there's a little bit more to it than that. Actually, you've got to, got to, you must get to the room on the other side. So basically, you just have to make your way through without getting spotted, which is all right. He's not very nice. Oh, he got me. Oh well, yeah. So there is a little bit more to it than that. Anyway, um, this was uh, Night Rider on the ZX Spectrum. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye bye now.